They are Ann and Nancy Wilson of Heart, two of the most visible and successful women in rock and roll. Ann writes most of the lyrics and sings lead vocals in three octave soprano, while her little sister Nancy dreams up the music. It's a successful powerhouse combination which has produced such hits as Magic Man, Crazy on You, Barracuda, Heartless, and Even It Up. Okay, Heart, this is take two, City's Burning. But for the last several months, the Wilson sisters have been holed up in their Seattle, Washington recording studio, working on their album with fellow Heart members Howard Lease, Michael DeRossier, and Steve Fawson. We spoke with Ann and Nancy about the early days of Heart back in 1975. It took a really long time for us to catch on. We just would go to, you know, Allentown, Pennsylvania, and we'd get Pennsylvania, and then we'd go down to the south, and we'd get the south. And, and there's always Moose Jaw, Saskatchewan. Yeah. Let us not yeah. forget. Regina. <laughs> Sudbury, all those and places. And that's uh, why it took a long time. It took about a year for us to really, I think, launch. Growing up in the middle-class suburb of Bellevue outside Seattle, the girls felt themselves apart from their super straight high school and found music to be an escape, especially the music of the Beatles and early influence on them. Their sense of humor and their kind of unique style of music that was always one step beyond, you know always ahead of the time, always unpredictable, was always kind of a goal for us, always kind of um, something we tried to emulate in our own fashion. The Beatles will be remembered as groundbreakers in both lyrics and style. And how does Anne want to be remembered? Well, I'd like to be remembered as someone who opened the door for women to just do whatever they heck they want on stage.